Hi, my name's Jennifer and I'm a teacher and I just wanted to know if adults and children should be treated differently when having a fever. A fever does have different implications, whether it's in an adult or in a child. In an adult, we really don't worry so much unless the fever gets up to about 105, 106, or if you've had a fever for over three days. Um, adults can fight off infection much better than especially small children, such as infants. Um, and in adults, you can use really any over-the-counter medication, such as ibuprofen or Tylenol, to cause the fever to go down. In children, it's very important to remember that Normal viruses can actually cause the temperature to be anywhere from 102 to 104 degrees. And although that may be concerning to the parents, it actually doesn't necessarily indicate that there's any problem other than the body fighting off infection. However, if the temperature gets up higher than that level, or it's there for a sustained period of time, or if the child appears lethargic, or is not eating, or appears dehydrated, then you definitely want to be concerned and call your physician. The big thing to remember about a child is to never give aspirin to a child who has a fever because there is a risk of causing something called Rye syndrome, which can be very uh, devastating to a child and even cause death.